the intersection where spirituality and the paranormal meet. Um, that's ultimately the depth of my work and um, how I work is I bridge spirituality and paranormal because it's been separated and it shouldn't be separated. Because when we understand who we are as spiritual beings, the paranormal, it just fits right. It just is what it is, right? Because when you start to truly understand who you are as a spiritual being, you start to hear, see, feel intuitively. And when you start to hear, see, and feel intuitively, you are not, I want to say, shocked or um, surprised by paranormal activity because paranormal activity is just a part of the universe, right? It's that we've become so um, stuck in this physical body and so consumed with the physical body only being um, matter. And if I can't see it, if I can't touch it, if I can't make sense of it, if I can't understand it, then it's nothing. It doesn't exist. It's not real. It's crazy. Paranormal tends to be much more tangible events, right? Someone sees something, um, like physically sees something with their eyes, not just their third eye or their intuition, right? They're, um, they're seeing objects move or they have an alien experience or, you know, it's sleep paralysis or whatever these different things are that take place. Um, but they take place in more of a physical experience. And so it's considered paranormal and tangible and something that I can prove almost. Um, and so with spirituality, spirituality isn't anything that we prove. It's an experience we have. It changes our life. It's a deeper understanding of who we are and why we are. And that inevitably inevitably goes in with paranormal work because in all the years that I've been doing the paranormal work specific, it is obvious and understood that if someone is having paranormal experience, they're being asked to learn, they're being asked to deepen their sense of who they are, they're being asked to go beyond just the physical. This isn't just some random experience that I'm supposed to come in and deal with. This is actually a conversation I need to have with this person about um, something much more deep is going on in your life. Something much more in, um, important is happening in your life. And because we are consumed with, well, if it doesn't have to do with my job or if it doesn't have to do with money, or if it doesn't have to do with this or that, then it's not important. Yet this is incredibly important because it will follow you if you don't address it. It will follow you if you don't acknowledge what it is. This is why so many people have continual paranormal activity. Now, of course, some people will have paranormal activity because they're, they see it, um, they're open to it. But if they aren't harnessing who they are and why they are, then it's just these random experiences that can become a nuisance. And that's not the way it should be. Our spirituality um, should blend and ultimately par paranormal kind of disappears because we understand who we are as spiritual beings. And we understand that we aren't by any means the only beings and that when we can communicate with beings above and beyond earth or up above and below earth, then there is so much more to this life and to this body than we can ever imagine.